Uh, now this. The Koch brothers investing millions on an ad campaign targeting Senators Claire McCaskill in Missouri and Joe Donnelly in Indiana. Roll tape. Tax reform is sweeping across Missouri. Small businesses are growing. Paychecks are going up. Families are saving more for what matters. Missouri pride is back. Senator Claire McCaskill said she'd support tax cuts for hardworking Missourians, but when she had the chance, she said no. Voting against tax cuts for you, standing with Chuck Schumer and Nancy Pelosi instead of us. Tell Senator McCaskill to put Missouri jobs first. All right, pretty plain and simple. Come on in, Tim Phillips, Americans for Prosperity president. Tim, uh, your group behind that Good ad night. and very clearly says, look, if you're for the tax reform, Thank you very much. But if you were against it, as the Democrats were, this is going to hurt you because come the midterms, it's going to be very hard for Democrats to explain why they voted against it. Absolutely. Senator McCaskill, Senator Donnelly in Indiana, really every Democrat, they said no to cutting taxes for the vast majority of Americans, including Americans struggling on the lower income ladder, middle class folks, and they chose partisan politics. They picked Nancy Pelosi, Chuck Schumer, Instead of giving the families and small businesses in their states like Missouri and Indiana a tax cut, I think it's going to be a very difficult vote for them to explain. They're trying. I don't think it's going to work, though. It was a terrible decision it was, what they did against tax they, cuts. They went all in, didn't they? They rolled the dice, they so did. to speak, to say, what we'll do is we're going to oppose this. We'll take up the strategy of resistance, and that will right. be enough. Um, and it could very well backfire, given what we've seen in the economy and the amount of money given back to, to the people of America. I think it's already backfiring. You saw the New York Times poll out today. Over 50% of Americans now view that tax cut and tax reform law favorably. They've seen the bonuses and the job, uh, the jobs being created and the new economic activity, more money. Folks are getting their February paychecks, mm -hmm. actually, and if there's more in there. This thing is absolutely going to backfire in these Democrats. And I, candidly, we hope they learn a lesson from this. They shouldn't choose partisan politics over cutting taxes and other good policies. Uh, the, the Tim, the Koch brothers, also backing Tennessee Congresswoman Marsha Blackburn as she runs right. for the Senate seat. Can she beat Bob Corker if he, in fact, decides to run again? Marsha Blackburn is a champion on economic freedom issues, and we absolutely believe she's going to be the next senator from the state of Tennessee. Mm -hmm. When some folks waffled on repealing Obamacare, like Senator Corker, Marsha Blackburn was a champion to do it. She was gutsy in that. When other folks were saying, well, maybe these tax cuts aren't a good idea, uh, Marsha Blackburn championed the biggest possible tax cut. She is the right person at this time for that job. All right, we'll have to leave it there. Tim Phillips, thank you so you much for joining us. We appreciate you it. Bet.